Hello to the chicos, hello to the chicas. The time has come for me to draw the winner, winner chicken dinner of this book, Marveloso. Uh, this sensational book, my great predecessor's Fisher edition. But you are going to get not this one, but one with a signature inside from the legend himself, Gary Kasparov. This is a giveaway to celebrate the fact that Kasparov has done um, my great predecessor's on chessable so this particular book is now also available on the chessable and i very 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 highly recommend you to go ahead ahead and check it out i might even chuck a link in the uh, description down below having said that i already did that in the previous video as well now let's get to the nitty-gritty uh, thanks for all the comments and the emails you sent me guys we have got exactly 160 interested people in wanting to win this book which is pretty awesome i didn't expect that many but i'm super delighted um to know that i entered all these names into this random picker but and before i do the deed i would like to just put forward a couple of disclaimers uh to avoid to be completely cramnicked so among the 160 there are four people that i know two are my students and i know another two two, Asian two, um, European two, um, other ways, uh, but I know who they are. So four out of the 160. Now, whilst I am putting this forward, I also am putting it forward that if they happen to win it, I'm going to let that, you know, happen. It's totally fair game as far as I'm concerned. And I don't see a reason why I should exclude those people from the competition. Now, I don't know why, but I've seen a number of times it's done on uh, online draws that when it comes to random picker, they don't take the first uh, pick or the second, but the third. So that is exactly what I'm going to do as well. So if your name comes up once, first or second, please do not bombard me with emails that you wanted because you didn't. Um, I don't have my wife, my boyfriend, my girlfriend, anyone in the run, so I have no agenda in elongating this any longer than necessary. It is simply, I understand that it makes it even more random than random. So on that note, without further ado, we are going to begin with pick random, pick random, and the third random is going to be the winner, winner, chicken dinner. So deep breath, ladies and gents, let's go. Um, number of picks, we want one. So the first non-winner, unfortunately, Lucas, you didn't win it. Um, unfortunately, Alicia Z, you also did not win it. However, our winner, Al Thompson, ladies and gentlemen, the winner of the signed Gary Kaspar of My Great Predecessors Fisher edition is none other than Al Thompson. For the record, neither a student nor an acquaintance of mine. So, phew. Uh, hopefully, Kramnik is not coming this way now. Check where I'm looking uh, on the recording, OBS. Um, yeah, so that's gonna be it for me now, ladies and gents. I don't think that I can add anything more to it. Ah, nah. I don't like letting you go without chess content. I'm gonna show you something. I played a game um, about uh, a half day ago. It was pretty awesome. So I'll show you the end of it because I found something really, really cool. Oh, no, 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 no. I just wanted that. No. Oh, boy. Why am I so untalented with this <sighs> yeah here we go so this was uh, a position from a recent game and uh here i had a marvelous idea to finish this uh contest off with um a very cool sack idea of queen e5 which i got a thumbs up for from the engine by the way Ooh. Don't look to the right, baby. Um, and the very cunning idea, which I'm, I was very proud of myself for, was, was that in case of capture on c6, instead of retaking, I was going to go to h5, setting up the mate threat, and if h4, then I still ignore this business, I take on here, and the move that I needed to see to make it 100% bulletproof was that here I can slide back here, denying the queen trade, and setting up the deadly mate threat in the end. Um, I might put this game up in its entirety on my YouTube channel, although um, what happened earlier wasn't uh, anything particularly flash. 
Um, but I thought that this attack in the end was pretty neat. The engine, by the way, doesn't favor queen e5, and that might again be a topic of another video. Know that knight c6, b6, bishop c6 would have been the exact same story with h4, bishop h4, queen d5, and bishop g5 blocking uh, the trade and delivering the checkmate, whereas if they take, of course, checkmate is completely unstoppable here. So now you got a little bit of a chess content as well. Once again, Al Thompson, congratulations on winning uh, the book. I'm going to reach out to you, friend, and uh, we'll take care of the rest of the business. Thank you guys very much for watching. Please um, don't forget to chuck a like button even on this video. Maybe a comment would be nice too, and I will be seeing you soon in the next one. Thanks for watching.